So I live in the South now, though. I love the South. Woo, get her done. Pew, 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 pew. I, uh, <laughs> I really, really enjoy living in the South. Uh, I like Southern women because you're beautiful and you're smart and you're ruthless. Oh, my God. Have you ever been insulted by a Southern woman? They do it with an ear-to-ear -ear grin. It's really mean. <laughs> Like they're happy to do it. You think they're all sweet little Suzanne sugar bakers, but then they just cut you down like a pie tree at Christmas. <laughs> What's the sharpest tool in their shed though? What do they say to get you? What is it? Bless your heart. That's it right there. It doesn't mean what you think it does. <laughs> Y'all hear what happened to Ray? He got fired and lost his job. <laughs> and his wife left him. Bless his heart. <laughs> Why are you laughing? Bless it, bless it. <laughs> It was funny until they got me. They were like, oh my God, Blair, I love your dress. It's all short and backless. Wish I could wear something like that, but I'm a Christian woman. <laughs> Does she think I won't beat her up because I'm in my church clothes? <laughs> oh, these earrings come off. Let's go. <laughs> I like traveling all over because the South has the most colorful people. Like I was in a gas station recently. I saw someone walk in wearing a Confederate flag cape. Yep, that's what I said too. I was very excited. It's not every day you get to see a redneck superhero. <laughs> he can leap tall trailers with a single bound. <laughs> oh man, and he, like, he saw me staring at him though, and he's like, hey, I won't let you know. This flag stands for heritage, not hatred. And I was like, okay, sir. And then he said the stupidest thing I've ever heard anyone say in my life. He's like, just won't let you know. I'm not racist. My brother's gay. No, sir, that's not how that works out. <laughs> Thanks for playing the game. <laughs> uh, I like watching TV. My favorite show right now is Ghost Adventures. Anybody in here watch Ghost Adventures? Yes, just a few people. We need to spread the word. It's a really good show. It's a group of white dudes. They walk into a house. They know it's haunted, and they taunt the ghost. <laughs> They're like, yo, bro. <laughs> I'm not scared of you, ghost. <laughs> Come at me, bro. <laughs> I'm at home like, <laughs> they're gonna get you. <laughs> Cause I'm black and I know ghosts are real. Um, <laughs> they had one black guy on the season, it was like a boom mic operator for like just one season, but then a chandelier shook overhead and he was like, mail my check, I'm out. <laughs> this is real. <laughs> My friends are always like, oh my God, why are you so afraid of ghosts? They can't get you. And I'm like, I'm not afraid of them getting me. It's just like, if they are real, there's probably one out there that's racist and that's the one that's gonna find me. Like my girlfriends took me down to a bachelorette party in Savannah, Georgia, and they're like, oh my God, Blair, tomorrow morning we're going on a ghost tour. <laughs> and I was like, no. <laughs> Y'all are going on a ghost tour. I'm gonna stay in the room and watch Ghost Adventures. <laughs> not paying $50 so Jebediah can chase me off his plantation. <laughs> Yelling Jigga, Jigga boo. <laughs> Thank you guys so much, that's my time. <laughs> <laughs>